Hi, this is Marty Carter with Sumner One Service. Today we're going to enter contacts into the address book on a Kyocera 4 series. I'm going to open up the internet. I'm going to clear the address field blank and I'm going to enter the IP address of the machine. That'll bring up the Kyocera command center. If you're blocked by a window saying that the site is untrusted, just click advanced and continue. Once here, select address book, machine address book, add, enter the contact name. In this case, I'm entering an email address. You could scroll further down and enter fax numbers if you'd like. After that, click submit. Then you'll click OK, and you're finished. You've entered that email address into the address book that'll appear at the control panel of the machine. Also at the control panel of the machine, you'll have the option to select one-touch keys. I like to put shortcuts there, destinations that are used most often. You must first enter the contacts into the address book before you can register them as a one-touch. Click one touch key, all of these are empty. So I'll pick the first one, key one, click settings, and then I'll select from the address book that contact, submit, submit again, and now I have a number and name in the address book, also stored as a one touch key. Now I'll show you how to do this at the control panel. Now we'll enter contacts into the address book from the machine control panel. From the home screen, touch send. Address book. Add edit. Add. Contact. Here we'll enter the person's name. We'll scroll to the email address to enter an email. Now you can also enter faxes if you'd like to enter a fax number into the address book. Here I'll enter the email address. Then I'll press register. Here I'm given the option to enter this as a one touch key. I'll show you what that is. I'll go ahead and press register. You choose an empty one touch. Next, choose the destination from the address book. Next, and then save. Now I'll show you what, what we've done here from the home screen when I touch send and I go to the address book, we'll see the new address. Also from the home screen, if we touch send and go to the one touch keys, we'll see the one touch. I like to use these as my favorites, people that I use most often. You don't have to enter them as a one touch, but the option is there. I'll close out, that's it, thank you.